welcome back to a, another video. We are back in Pokemon Pearl Randomizer once again, and we are going to continue where we left off. So last time we got the first gym badge. So now we're going to head out and go to, I think it's Floroma Town if I remember correctly, but first we have to go back to Jubilife City. So we will run back there really quick. So let's keep going. So I think I think I'm okay with supplies and right now what right now so oh hello hello satin oh running right into me how could you whoops Sandra you got the gym badge huh Eternity City is the next place with a gym that gives away badges right so yeah I went to Route 207 but you can't go there without a bicycle I made my team battle and toughen them up so it wasn't a waste that's good uh, so I'm going back to Jubilee City next stop the Eternity Gym badge. Ten seconds before I dash. Nine. Bah, who's got time to count? Well, definitely not you. You never have time to count. Uh, so yeah, let's just keep going. Let's follow him. Okay. I don't even know if I actually hunted around here for a Pokemon in there. But I know I've hunted around here. And if I remember correctly, couldn't I get a Mewtwo on this route? I'm pretty sure I could. I'm not going to try and catch one though. Because I did. It was, oh, there's no way I'm getting it. Okay, so we did that, and we don't really need to heal, because we didn't really fight anything. So, do I have a good amount of items, though? Let's check before we go. I have one potion. I should probably get some more. Yeah, so let's go ahead and get some more potions. We have some Pokeballs, so I think we'll be okay. I think. I hope we will be. <laughs> okay. Do I actually have a anything to sell let me check really quick because I can't remember if I have anything like no I don't okay yeah I don't have anything to sell because I know I was getting like random items I couldn't remember what I had because I know if I ever got a nugget I would forget to sell it uh let's just stick no let's how many can I get of these I can only get three okay let's actually just stick with the regular potion and we'll get like four of those so we'll have five and I guess we can get a couple more Pokeballs. Maybe like four more. Make it 15. Because you don't know. what You never know what you're going to run into. So. Let's keep on going. I think up here we have a battle too as well. Don't we? Or am I thinking of. Nope we do. Here we go. Ah oh, Sandra. Impeccable timing as always. These miscreants are babbling utter nonsense that I just can't stomach. Show them manners, if you will. Oh, Professor Rowan, must you be so difficult? We are approaching you strictly as businessmen. All you must do is provide us with all your research findings. In return, we'll refrain from causing massive damage to your assistant. Seriously? Like, legit, come on. <sighs> come on. Like, oh uh, boy, okay, whatever. <laughs> Sandra, join me and battle these guys, of course. Darn Team Galactic. I do like Team Galactic, though. As an evil team, I do like them. Okay, so we're challenged by both Galactic Grunts. And a Mankey and a Kingler. Okay. Well, I should be able to do fine against the Kingler. Oh, you have a Cranidos. Okay. Alright. You might be in trouble, dude. <laughs> okay, let's go ahead and Thundershock the Kingler. He uses Leer, and it even... Uh, okay, he's got Leer. It's fine. It's not going to help much. Your Cranidos is going to go down, dude. Okay, that actually didn't do that much. What is Mankey going to do, though? Mankey's got to have a Fighting-type move. Low kick. Yeah, there is ganging up on his Cranidos. Oh! Go, Fluffy. I can't remember, was Cranidos? I think Cranidos was one of the three starters. I can't remember, it's been so long since I did the first part, but I think that was one of the starters. That was, I can't remember what the other one was, though. Was it a, I want to say it was another water type? That might have been some other one I've played, though. I can't remember, it's been a while. I'll figure it out eventually. And Fluffy, oh, Fluffy is gaining the levels of a 14. Thunder Wave, awesome. And there goes Cranidos. <laughs> oh boy, okay. Alright, alright, it's fine. It's fine, we got this. 
I uh, hope you guys are having a good day. I'm doing alright so far. I got a day off from work. I got today and tomorrow off, and then I go back on Wednesday. So, I'm honestly, I am recording this. I'm gonna have this. This is gonna be uploaded along a couple days after I record it. So, like, I don't know. It'll probably be uploaded Saturday, maybe. I don't know. So, Saturday or Sunday, probably. We'll see. But it's going to be a lot farther away from when I actually recorded. So I hope you guys have been having a good week, though. I have just been working and doing schoolwork, so... Yeah. Uh, you leave us no option. We will retreat for now. Because Team Galactus is benevolent to all, we shall leave. Good. We don't, we don't want to deal with you anymore. <laughs> that lot. They call themselves Team Galactic. When Pokemon evolve, they seem to release some type of energy... However, I believe that it's a mystic power far beyond our control. But Team Galactic seems to be trying to use that power for something. Anyway, Sandra, well done. You battle quite capably. The sight of you trainers and Pokemon battling together. I made the right decision in entrusting you with a Pokedex. Sandra, did you know about this? The professor studies about the evolution of Pokemon, too. According to his research, 90% of all Pokemon are somehow tied to evolution. I guess that means some Pokemon must undergo weird evolutions. So, Sandra, let's keep working on our Pokedex project for the professor. Alright, so there we go. Oh, hello. Oh, that was very good. Nicely done. Truly excellent. Oh, I beg your pardon. I'm from Jubilife TV. I'd like you to have something for letting me see that smashing battle. And we got the fashion case. Alright. And we know what the fashion case is. It's got accessories and stuff. You can dress your Pokemon up and we don't need to hear this. We don't need to read that, because I'm not really going to pay much attention to the fashion case or the contests, really, in this game. I mean, I do like that they have them, but I don't think I'm going to be really using them. We got a sharp beak. Ooh, we should give that to Clint. Let's give that to Clint. No, 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 no toss, no toss. Oh, okay, that would have been very bad. All right, Clint has a sharp beak now. And I guess Fluffy's actually caught up to Clint now so in levels, so that's really good. What can I find in this grass, actually? Let's see. Anything? I was going to say, it was looking like nothing for a second. Like, can Oh, there's a Vespa Queen. Okay. Or Vespa Quinn. I always call it Vespa Queen, but it, I'm pretty sure it's actually Vespa Quinn. Let's actually go ahead and... I should be super effective, honestly. Let's just take it out, because I feel like a Vespa Quinn should give us good XP. Let's see, does it, it's only level 4. It still goes 107 though, that's actually pretty good. That's pretty good for a level 4, <laughs> I mean. What else lives in this grass? I'm just, I just want to know, is there anything I want? Oh, there's a Rhydon, okay. I don't want a Rhydon, but okay, there's a Rhydon. Alright, so let's go ahead and get away from Rhydon. Anything else? There's got to be more than just those two. I know there has to be, but it's like, what is it? Oh, look what lives here. <laughs> Piplub. Well, guess what, Piplub? I already have your evolution. <laughs> so, yeah. Okay, let's go ahead and get away from that. Uh, I think we'll go can keep going, though. I can always come hunt later. Or we'll, maybe we'll run into something on our way through the route. You never know. I'm not a weak-looking trainer. Fight me. You'll see I'm not weak. You, you, would you like to meet Shasta? Shasta's actually laying behind me right now. She's kind of chilling in my room with me. We've been, I edited a video just before this, did some studying, and now I'm recording. So, yeah, I'm kind of taking a chill, having a chill day today, because I've got a quiz tomorrow, so. Yeah. <laughs> Fluffy just, uh, okay, now electricity's power is getting weakened, but it's fine. We'll be fine. One more Thundershock will take it out. Is that the only Pokemon you have too? Yes it is, so that's honestly good, because then this is easy. When does Fluffy evolve? I can't remember. I know it's got to be soon. I'm pretty sure I should get a Flaffy really soon. Is it level 15? I want to say it's level 15. I'm not positive though. Okay, nothing there. There's a guy to battle. So let's fight this guy too. Your dad gave you some Pokemon. All right, well, let's see these Pokemon, dude. Let's see what you got, because I'm curious. 
Oh, you got a quillfish. All right. Fluffy's just getting like all the lucky shots right now. Like Fluffy's just destroying. I'm glad we picked Fluffy up when we found it, found her. Because Fluffy's just doing work. Fluffy's doing work. And there goes Quillfish. <laughs> I mean, not that our Pokemon couldn't have handled these, but I mean, I think Fluffy's a very good addition to this team. And level 15. Now I guess we'll figure out. And a Krikatot. Okay, let's go ahead and switch into Clint then. Let's let Clint get in on the action here. Because I don't want anyone to fall behind. I really don't want anyone to fall behind in level. Alright, Krikatot. Wing attack. You you can buy it all you want, Krikatot. I don't think you're le you're living this wing attack. <laughs> Just saying. This is the most normal Pokemon he could have had. <laughs> A Krikatot. That's the most normal one he could have had. Oh, I'm going to have to teach someone Rock Smash too. I just realized... I don't want to teach any of them Rock Smash. No, the one I'm going to have to teach. Oh! Fluffy's evolving! Yay! Fluffy's evolving into Flappy. Flappy Fluffy. It is so similar. So similar. It's fine, though. Fluffy. Here we go. Good Fluffy. <laughs> Amazing Fluffy. I wonder, can Fluffy learn Rock Smash? I doubt it. That'd be great if it could. Let's see. I want. I'm just curious. Can it learn Rock Smash? Or is Empoleon the only one? I really don't want to teach it to Empoleon. You can. Awesome. Okay. Actually, that could be really helpful. So I'm actually gonna just teach it to Fluffy. That could be helpful against like Rock types and stuff. Or the ro Rocking Ground, I should say, because Rock types Fluffy could still handle. Like you can Electric types still work on rock types but okay let's just keep on going then though yes you can trouble me for a battle i will win at least i'm hoping as long as you don't have a legendary i will win what do you have samantha a carvana carvana okay again we're getting very lucky here go fluffy go fluffy oh uh... I'm just loving Fluffy right now. <laughs> I'm just loving Fluffy. Honestly, my favorite Pokemon game, randomized. I love it. I Honestly, 4th gen, per Pearl is where I started, so it's always going to be my favorite one. It's always going to be. At least I think it will be. Anything? Okay. Yeah, you're just telling us about the boulders. Well, let's go and smash those boulders. It's actually, is there an item up here? I want to say there is, so I'm going to check. Thank you, Fluffy. Thank you, Fluffy. There is. Oh, we got Dream Eater. Okay, that's actually pretty good. That is a pretty good move to have. If we get a ghost type, probably going to use that. A blue berry. Blue. Blue. Not blue. Blue. <laughs> Say, so what lives in this cave exactly? I would like to know. Can I encounter something? Thank you. A Shellos. Again, not very... Not very exciting. It's just a Shellos. We can find Shellos in the normal game. I want, like, a really random Pokemon. <laughs> Honestly, I want a Legendary. But we all know that's probably not going to happen. Do you want to fight? No, you don't want to fight. Okay, it's fine. It's whatever. Okay, let's go ahead and fight her. She normally has Bidoof, so I'm pretty sure. <laughs> I'm pretty sure, or is that someone else? I don't know. She, I think it was her, but I'm not sure. But I know she probably doesn't have it now. Oh, a gulpin. Okay, we have a gulpin. I've never used a gulpin or a swalot, so never actually used one. I never really had the desire to. Poison types aren't necessarily like my forte, I guess. Although I do like crobat. I do like crobat. I think that's like kind of the one that everyone always loves. Although the poison types have become a lot more useful now that they're super effective on fairy types. <laughs> like, oh man. You gotta have something to counter the fairy type. Oh my, oh, okay, um, um, you have a Mewtwo, okay, um, 
This girl has a Mewtwo. Uh, what do I have that could do it? Okay, we're just gonna stay in. This is, um... Um... Okay, um, we're just going to... I don't know if you have Synchronize. Don't disable me. No disable. Okay, that actually did a lot of damage. Confusion. We might be okay. <laughs> yeah, we're fine. We're fine. Okay, I was freaking out for nothing. <laughs> that girl has a Mewtwo, dang it. <laughs> it's Mewtwo. How can you not freak out when you see that someone has a Mewtwo? <sighs> and you don't have a type advantage. Okay, Fluffy is now level 16. I think Fluffy should... I should switch Clint up front, I believe. Because Clint is a lower level. Once Clint gets to level 16, then I can switch up Shasta back up front, and then we can just go from there. So let's go. We made it past the Mewtwo, which is good. Have we got a Grip Claw? Okay, nice, nice. Hello, Bug Catcher. What do you have? Do you actually have bugs? If you actually have bugs, that'll be great. I mean, really, it would be great if you actually have bugs. Because I have a flying type. <laughs> you actually have a Weedle! <laughs> You actually have a Weedle, dude. <laughs> I mean, you don't have to make this so easy on me, dude. Come on. You don't have to make this so easy on me. The last girl had a Mewtwo. <sighs> Watch. This guy has, like, another legendary. He has a Weedle and then a legendary. Oh, you have a Glaceon. Oh. Okay. That... Yeah, let's go with Shasta. Because definitely not leaving Clint out. You have a Glaceon. I'm kind of jealous, honestly. I want a Glaceon. I love Glaceon. I love Glaceon, honestly. Glaceon is just so... Such a cool Pokemon. I love Glaceon. There we go. Good job, Shasta. wonder if my dog actually thinks I'm talking to her. And level 17, let's go. Alright. So you had one bug, so... You had one, and we don't have cut yet. Uh, let's fight these twins, though. What do these twins have? I'm the, I'm curious. Like, normally they both have Pachirisus. What do you have? Do you actually have the same Pokemon? I'm actually curious. A Badoo and a Geodude. Okay. That's actually pretty good for us right now, because we have Clint and Shasta up front. So Clint can take out Badoo, and then Shasta can take out the Geodude. So let's wing attack Badoo, and then you use Bubble. I guess you can hit both, so why not? Why not? I forgot, Bubble hits both targets on a double battle. Alright, well there went Badoo. <laughs> And both gained 64. Okay, that's not a lot, but it's okay. It's okay. I'll take it. Alright, there we go. Easy peasy. And Clint is now level 15. When's Cl Oh, when does Taylor evolve? It's like... I'm pretty sure it's like in the 20s. 20, 21, somewhere around there. I think. Because a swallow will be nice. Is there an item over here? There is. What are you? Frustration. Okay. Okay. I'll take it. Probably not going to use it, but I'll take it. And what did we find right before we got to the town? <gasps> you are mine. You are mine. Okay. I have to have you. Oh. I don't want to kill it. I don't want to kill it. I really don't want to kill it. I want you so bad. <laughs> oh, I know it's another starter, but I don't care. I want it. I just want it. Paralyze yourself. Then I don't have to go. There we go. See, there we go. Okay. Okay. What is your weakest move, Flaffy? Or Fluffy? I think it's tackle, but I'm just checking. Yeah, it's tackle. 
Okay, and what's your attack stat? Your attack stat is 25. So is yours. Um, okay. I'm just gonna go for it and hope it doesn't kill. Don't kill it. Don't kill it. Don't kill it, Fluffy. It's I'm 10 levels higher. Okay, we're fine. Because that would be my luck. She'd get a crit and then I would lose this Charmander. I know I could get another one because, I mean, we're in this grass, but I really don't want to have to go to the trouble of hunting another one down. Come on. I know you're a starter Pokemon, but come on. Thank you. We got a Charmander. I'm happy. <gasps> oh. <gasps> okay, now what am I going to name you? Probably, oh, what do I want to name you? I think I'm going to call you Zuko. Or do I want to... Because, I mean, that's Avatar. Uh, do I want to name you Zuko or is there another name I can think of? I feel like there should be another name I'm thinking of right now. Uh, I've been playing a lot of Fire Emblem recently, too, so that might help. Uh, What do I want to call you? Oh. Or should I just go with Zuko? Honestly, I'm just gonna... I'm gonna call you Zuko. I like the name Zuko, so... I like the name Zuko. I know a bunch of people will use that name for, like, their fire types, but I really like the name Zuko. We have a Charmander. I'm happy. Oh, let's check out... Let's see Zuko. Oh. You're naughty. You're a naughty Zuko. Okay, and you blaze. Okay, and just scratch and growl right now. We are level 6, though, so... I am happy with that. Let's actually go ahead and switch you up front. So we can do a little bit of switch training along our journey here. Okay, let's. We made it to Florima Town now, so let's go ahead and heal. Oh, I'm very happy now. I have a Charmander. <laughs> That's a fire type, too. That's a good addition to the team. That is a very good addition to the team. I know he's going to be half flying, and we already have a flying type, but at the same time, I don't care. I just do not care. Okay, but with that, I think this is a good stop, a good place to end this episode off. It's been about 20 minutes, a little over. So I hope you guys have enjoyed this part in the vid in the series. If you did and you want to see more, make sure you hit that like button, comment and subscribe for more videos. Also, make sure you hit that notification bell so you don't miss out on anything. And yeah, thank you guys so much for watching, and I will see you all next time.